from across the country have been invited. And the first of them to face the coaches tonight is 21-year-old Joelle Moses. She's desperate to step out of the shadows and take centre stage. I've been trying to make for like about five years now. I've done backing vocals for artists such as Gabriella Chomi and Rihanna Tony Braxton. It's a very tough industry and it's um, really hard to get noticed and be heard. It's a bittersweet situation because it's amazing to be doing these songs for these huge artists, but at the same time you kind of think, oh, I wish that was my song. Try to working with everyone and anyone you know will work with me. I would love to be able to emulate their kind of success. I think this could be my chance and my opportunity to be able to shine and be in the front instead of working behind somebody else. so much for turning around for me. Uh, listen, it's, look, it's your voice and you that made us turn around. It wasn't nothing else, you know? Within the first couple of bars, I was sold. You know, I think you did a fantastic job. You really made that song your own. And I really feel that, uh, that me and you would have uh, a, a great chemistry together. And I hope you'll be able to. <laughs> Not in that way. <laughs> Not that way. Oh, I don't mind chemistry between oh, me and you, Danny. It's on. It's on. Um, yeah, so, you know, uh, I have to say, I think your control is incredible, your breathing is incredible. I would I'd give my left arm to, to work with a singer like you. Oh, wow. Wow. One thing that kind of came to my mind was I'd love to write a song for you. And I don't often think that, to be honest. I'm very, very picky about voices that I like to write for. And to hear you sing a song that has so much story as well as, you know, tone and that's needed, and you carried it. And as a female to female, uh, I would like you in my team. Our voices together could be insane. I love you, Jessie J. I love you too. I really do. <laughs> I would just like to say that too much of the same thing can be a bad, can be a bad, bad, bad thing. <laughs> I know I don't sing like Jessie or yourself or Adele, but I know how to work with good singers, produce them and stuff like that. <laughs> So I know how to take an artist from here to there. I mean, I like to, you know, work with you as an artist. Thank you so much. Thank you. 
Let me just say that I can't compete with, uh, with these people as far as doing things for you, but... Uh... <laughs> but no, no, I, no I, I really love the way you sing, and, and that's, that's what I look for. From me, it's coming from here, sweetie. Now you get the chance here to, uh, to pick any of us. I would like to say I did press first, though. <laughs> what size are you? Uh, seven, well, sometimes eight. You know, <laughs> that's what I'm saying, if you can share shoe collections. <laughs> Honestly, I'm, I'm just so humbled <laughs> by you guys turning around for me. Thank you so much. <laughs> Honestly, go with your heart. I, I, I gotta go with my gut instincts. And it's telling me... Will I am. So after an epic battle, Mr. Persuasive Will I Am adds Joelle to his team. Oh, I really wanted that girl. She's great, wasn't she? Yeah, she was tremendous. She was really good. <laughs> I feel just incredible. I <laughs> honestly, I am so, so, so glad. I have been trying for a very, very long time to try and make my dream come true and you know, I think this could be the beginning of something amazing. I didn't think she was going to pick me. You know, I thought she was probably going to go with Jessie J, because Jessie J is like the singer. I cried a little bit inside. <laughs> she was brilliant, and I, I'm really sad. She was singing from a, a, a deep place, and, and whatever it was was hitting me. Yeah, I, I felt me and Joelle had a certain chemistry, but, uh, you know, hey, can't win them all. I got to try harder now. <laughs> I got to ramp it up, don't I? <laughs> <laughs> 